In our fourth video of the series, we are looking at the young man, if I may call him so, Nicholas Janser van Rensburg, who was included in the 46 man Springbok squad to take on Georgia and the British and Irish Lions. In this video, I would like to have a quick profile view of who Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg is, where he came from, what he's done to date in his career, and what is his prospects within the Springbok setup. So, Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg, he was born in Pretoria, who is the little unknown capital city of South Africa, and Pretoria is also known as Blue Bulls Country. And Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg, he represented the Blue Bulls at the Curry Cup uh, week in 2012. One thing I must add, what I've noticed in the series, and what I've noticed is that to date, all of these players, they participated in a Craven Week tournament. So, Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg also participated in the 2012 Under 18 Craven Week tournament. He also represented South Africa in the 2014 IRB Junior World Championship in the same team that Joseph Dweba participated in, the, the player I profiled before this video. That particular team consisted of very talented players. I mentioned it in my previous video. Andre Pollard was part of that team. Thomas the Toit, the Krill brothers, Andre Esterhuizen, Warwick Galant, all those guys, guys were part in a particular or in a very talented junior Springbok team that beat New Zealand twice and narrowly lost to England in the final. So, Nicholas Jansen van Rensburg was also the first choice lock in a particular team. So, from an early age, he had immense talent and it was only a matter of time before he star would rise. So, he joined the Bulls in 2014 up until 2016 when in 2016, he continued his career at Montpellier up until currently, we are still playing. So this is just my opinion, but I think one of the reasons why Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg was included in this particular team, bearing in mind the Springboks currently have a plethora of world-class quality locks in the setup. Now Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg is a little bit like Peter Stefter Toy, um, someone that can play lock as well on the, the flank and what I've seen in the past with the Springbok coaches they sometimes prefer players that are versatile they can play a couple of positions, other positions other than their major positions so I think that the inclusion of Nicholas Janssen van Rensburg it's a good it's a good compliment to the team I think the fact that he came up the junior ranks with South African rugby it's just fitting for him to actually get an opportunity to represent South Africa in, in this particular calendar year. If it isn't in the British and Irish Lions series, it will definitely be probably in the Rugby Championship or the end of your tour to Europe. So I think his inclusion is fitting. What do you think? Please feel free, feel free to, to comment, feel free to give your opinion. I do read the comments, I do respond to the comments. So thank you for watching my video and until the next one. Thank <laughs> you.